come amid the federal probe into the former Secretary of State's emails. The new message to supporters is no bedwetting, which is borrowed from President Obama's 2008 campaign. Meanwhile, reports persist that Vice President Joe Biden is considering entering the race. Donald Trump is pulling ahead of his Republican presidential rivals. The latest CNN poll shows the billionaire real estate developer leading with 24% support from registered Republican voters. That's up six points from the last CNN national poll in July. His closest competition is former Florida Governor Jeb Bush, who is polling at 13%. And Mayor de Blasio is vowing to stop topless women with their breasts painted posing in Times Square. WLR Scott Pringle reports from the mayor's comments today. Mayor de Blasio says he's dancing and collecting money from people in Times Square. This situation is going to change. This is what I'll guarantee you. I, I'm not going to tolerate it. Uh, we're going to change things. I think we have just begun to recognize all the tools available here. Uh, but, you know, this is a situation that I don't accept, and we will deal with very aggressively. The mayor says there are some things we can do right away for enforcement, but other things that need legislation. I'm Scott Pringle for the New 710 WOR. Did they or didn't some New York City firefighters cheat on a promotions exam? WOR's Alice Stockton Mercini reports. Column New York's bravest cheater. Sarah Lane will you up from the prospect, and then more volume up to the Conscious Go Bridge because of an earlier stall. The Bronx, eastbound Bronx, here into the Bronx River Parkway. Earlier accident now out of the way. Westbound Bronx, and the Westbound Ramp. 